Match six in three, two, one, go! And on the Red Alliance, we see all three of the robots depositing their starting game pieces and 971 and Madtown racing back with two more. And in five final seconds of Autonomous, looks like they are managing to score every free game piece on their side of the field if they manage to get it in place in time. And 971 making it onto their charging station as well. And Blue Alliance, although they do not start Telly up with the lead, seems like they have plenty of time to try and make that up. Already depositing a couple of game pieces into the upper row. However, it will be difficult to keep up with the pace of scoring of the Red Alliance. Already, it seems they have five game pieces placed in the upper row and courtesy of Madtown soon to make that six. And Madtown taking the place of Alliance partners, 971, both rushing back from their loading zone. Cones in tow. Lining up, trying to get those placed, and once again, they both place those on the middle row this time. And once again, we see that pair of Red Alliance robots back at their loading station. Madtown already racing back, launching a cone as they go, not even stopping to place that, but it does manage to slide into place in a hybrid node. And we have just about 50 points separating our alliances at the time being. Blue Alliance robot trying to keep up that pace of scoring. And it is nothing to shake a stick at themselves. Iron Panthers placing a cone in the upper row for the Blue Alliance. And Pecan and Bird Brains racing up and over their charging station, trying to place that cube in the upper row as well. However, with a minute left to go, Red Alliance is handily hanging onto that lead. Seems like they are patiently step by step filling out that Red Alliance grid. Just about. Every game piece that is free on the field has already been claimed by one alliance or the other. Seems human players for the Blue Alliance, they are tossing those cubes out onto the field right in that Red Alliance community. And with 30 seconds left to go, it seems like Red Alliance taking advantage of that. And it looks like they may have just about managed to fill up that grid with 20 seconds left to go. We see Madtown and Duncan Dynamics on the charging station for the Red Lions, and they do manage to get it level. 15 seconds left. Looks like that is where the Red Lions is content to finish their match. Blue Lions, meanwhile, trying to eke out a final few points. We have both Iron Panthers and Buchanan Bird Brains on the charging station, but in the final three seconds, Iron Panthers lose their footing and do not maintain a hold of the station. A score of 187 points to the Blue Alliance is 95. Red Alliance coming away with all four possible ranking points in that match.